welcome to another vlog. We are. Hi. How are you? Very cool, meetings. We are doing another vlog today. I'm here with Kathleen. We're spending the day together. We're doing lots of fun things, actually. We are. What's the bakery we're going to called? Uh, ooh, I don't make me say that pronounced. <laughs> I'm with an A. I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Ariscult. Ariscult. And it's in. It's on Clement. We're in hate right now. We're in the Richmond. Yeah, in the Richmond. We're on hate right now. We're gonna get a copy. We're gonna go to Ariscult. Then we're gonna come back here and we're gonna thrift. And we're gonna go to the plant shop, The Mellow, which I haven't taken you guys to. So it's a, good. It's and a the crystal good one. shop. And the crystal shop. We have lots of stuff to make today. Me being shy. <laughs> Don't be shy. <laughs> we got our coffees. I got a Audrey Hepburn. I got ice. Every single time I get a hot coffee, I feel like someone's gonna take away my queer card. So we did ice today. And then Kathleen got also iced. What was yours? John Lennon. John Lennon. I wish I got oat because. Oh, you didn't get oatmeal? No, but my tummy. Oh, anyway. Another thing that Fun would fact. get your queer card removed. Fun fact. I'm also born on the same day as John Lennon. There you go. It girl. I am not born on the same day as RJ Hepburn. You might have I wish a celebrity, I would. you know, birthday twin. I don't know. I actually don't know. Google. If you know any celebrity born on April 8th, let me know. Because that's my birthday. We share a birthday. We're here, there she is. There's a long ass line. We're trying to figure out what we want to eat. So we're looking at the Yelp. I feel like there's some croissants. The that almond one. croissant. That's the one. A must get. That looks delicious. They have savory ones too. We're trying to get two things. Because I think the optimal way of like trying a new place is that you get as many options as possible and you share. So you can try a lot of things. So, so we know next time we go back what we'll we we'll like. And we'll 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 right. So we're gonna get an almond croissant for sure, because that sounds delicious. We can um, do a regular one, or if you have a sweet tooth, we can have a pan of Should we do chocolate? Pan of chocolate? They have a lot of different kinds. Look at that chocolate almond one. They have a, <laughs> does that say cowboy coconut scone? Cranberry. <laughs> it says cranberry coconut scone. We're gonna get something good. I'm, I'm very confident with something. Whatever we get is gonna be good. Thank you. Thank you. We got the good. Okay, so we have the almond croissant. You see her? Powdered sugar. Mm. We got this one. And then we got the cumin, which I recently learned the pronunciation of. And it's like a caramelized type one. No, it's upside down. Wait, is it? <laughs> I don't think so. It looks upside down. It can, it no, again. it looks the same. <laughs> Are you sure? Okay, show me. Yeah, no, I think. Oh, okay. There's the cream on. And then. Beautiful shot. The almond croissant. Oh. Yum. This is a good thumbnail. Our selections are right here. Ooh. I'm excited. I think it's going to be good. Which one should we try first? This one. This one? Okay. Right. Let me show you it. <laughs> I'm, I'm <laughs> she said, <laughs> Delicious. I'm <laughs> pretty fucking good. Mmm. It's good, right? The paste, the almond paste inside, hella good. Mm. It's good. good. And then we have the quinoa. Mmm. You wanna try that one first? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I want. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That's. Very flaky. Flaky. Very buttery. Buttery. I can taste the caramelization. Butter on top. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be custard in them. It was in the last Kunyaman I had, there was custard in mine. Maybe it's in the middle. 
Oh, I see. Good. Messy. I'm mashing. They both are. They're flaky. Mmm. I like it though. Oh, God. We are going to go get food now. We're going to Jijime, which is this like kind of Korean Asian fusion type place. Did we pass the elder there? <laughs> to go to the plant store the mellow there's also a cute bookstore here we have to go to the crystal shop yep we got a lot of stuff mandatory so let's go she's a mona lisa everyone's lining up to see her she's a mona lisa everyone's lining up to see her there must be something bad See her walking down the boulevard She got the posture of a superstar She looks so fly in those Gucci slides Yeah, yeah, I wonder what she hides Under her disguise Yeah, 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 yeah And all the girls around the world They wanna be her And all the dudes are trying to score Like it's fever She lives a double life Puts on a show What's under the subtle smile She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features You'll find her beauty goes much deeper Once you get to meet her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features You'll find her beauty goes much deeper Hello, so Kathleen went to go get her nails done. She had a nail appointment, so she had to go. But we didn't have time to hit any thrift stores, and I really wanted to, so I'm going by myself right now to Indigo Vintage, which is like a kind of newish one on Hate, but it's really cute. It's kind of expensive, not gonna lie, but it's like very like nice aesthetic. I also got a plant at the Mellow, which you guys saw. I got like the Palea Peperomia, which I've been wanting one. I did get one at the Sill, but then I broke it and then it died. It was really sad, but this time it will be alive. Uh, I have to get a plant pot for it. I'm gonna see if there's a different place to get it because the ones at the Mel are kind of expensive, but if not, I'm probably just gonna get that one because they are cute, just a little expensive. So we're gonna see if I can find a different one. Damn, okay, never mind. It said on Google they're still open, that sucks. Well, here you can see it's cute. I like this one, I'm sad it's closed. Okay, luckily Wasteland is right across the street and Goodwill is right over there. So we're gonna go to those instead. Not the best angle. Um, I haven't found the most things. I found like three things. I'm not having the best look. Um, one of them I'm definitely not gonna buy because it's stupid expensive. I wanna try it on just like torture myself. So I have three things. I'll try them on. Oh, this is not a good angle. There's just like nowhere else to, to put it. But this is the first one. It's this Reformation dress and it's only $38 kind of sus but I'm thinking maybe like they haven't been able to sell it so maybe it's discounted but okay you fell um yeah let me see I don't know if it's gonna fit it seems a little tiny but maybe we'll see we'll see okay so one it does not fit not zipping up two it's like stupid short like like <laughs> 
<laughs> this is not passing any type of school dress code rule here. It's just, it's really short, like unnecessarily short. But maybe because it's like too small on me, it just doesn't fit me. Like maybe I'm a smaller person, this wouldn't be so short. So I think it's just, it's not for me. It's cute. I think that was why it was $38, because like a very small person would have to buy this for it to like fit them well. But it's really cute. So if you are a small person, <laughs> come to Wasteland, this is a cute dress. Okay, admittedly, I did not check the size on anything. <laughs> this one also doesn't fit, but this one is also very cute. Again, if you're a small person in San Francisco, Bay Area, whatever, come to Wasteland because there's some there's some options for you. Not for me, no, this is, I can't even button it. But look how cute, it's a very cute pattern. I wish it did fit. Okay, we're 0 for 3 on sizing. I didn't check. I, I really didn't. I, I just feel like when I like something at the thrift store, I just grab it because you never know how it's going to fit. But this does not fit. This is the one that I'm trying on just to torture myself because it's like $130. But look how beautiful. Are you kidding me? Ugh, I'm glad it doesn't fit because if it fit me like a glove, I would buy it. It would, it would it would be meant to be. Like I would have to get it. So yeah, this one not fitting. I'm holding it from the back, but oh, it's so pretty. It's from the brand Lan Lanvin Paris. I don't know it, maybe too broke to know the brand, but how nice. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. All right, but these were all, unfortunately, a no. If you are a small person in the Bay Area slash San Francisco, this is me putting you on. Uh, also, if you have $130 and you're a small person in San Francisco, please come buy this. Someone get it. It's, oh, look at it. Oh, I came up. I can't get over it. It's so nice. Okay, so now all these a bust. Okay, no go at Wasteland. Didn't find anything. Admittedly, I usually don't find a ton there that's like in my budget. Were there a ton of things I would buy if I had unlimited money? Yes. But we're gonna do a quick sweep of Goodwill because I have to get back to yeah. the Mellow at seven because they're holding my plant for me until the end of the day and they close at seven. So it's like. 6:40 right now so we're gonna do a quick little sweep see what's there and then we're gonna head back to the mellow okay once again just no luck like thrifting is just not the move today i guess like indigo vintage was closed nothing at a wasteland fit me that i liked i know i didn't check the sizes but nothing at wasteland and then goodwill too i didn't find anything so i'm just gonna go back to the mellow right now to get my plant and also get the pot because i also couldn't find a cute pot anywhere just not a good day for thrifting but it's okay otherwise really successful day i did get some incense i guess i'll show you guys that i got at the crystal shop but other than that we're just getting in the plant Okay, hello, I'm home now. So yeah, today was not a good day for thrifting. Like anywhere, I just wasn't having any luck. So no clothes, but I did get a plant, which is what matters, right? Like that's that's what we came to do. So I got a plant and it's so cute. I'm very excited about it. Um, I also went and got incense at the crystal shop that we went to. And I had gotten four different incense and just somewhere along the way I dropped two of them. I think it was when my camera fell when I was in the wasteland dressing room and I just didn't realize I was so irritated at myself. Like they're like a dollar for each so it's not like I lost like something that costs hella money but it was I got four flavors, flavors, <laughs> scents, the smells of the incense and I got two that I was like excited about and then two I was like oh I'll try these out these seem interesting. It was the ones that just seemed interesting that I wanted to try out that I didn't lose and I lost a uh, rose which is my favorite and then a tangerine one which I actually haven't tried but that just sounds so nice. I love citrus scents so I was very excited about it. Instead the ones I do have are coconut mango and uh, cinnamon apple but now the main event the plant is the bag very cute. I got the same plant but I got it much bigger. Oh, it's so cute! Oh, I love it so much! 
I also got the pot and this was it was a more expensive pot like it was like uh, $17 and yeah it's expensive but look how nice it is oh like I was trying to find one at like a hardware store or, like Goodwill and while those would have been fine and the plant still would have looked really cute in my room like this is nice like this is a nice pot so I got this one um, all together I guess it was like closer to 40 which is a lot but I'm so happy look at me <laughs> So, I also just got paid. I deserve nice things. But that's gonna be it for the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. I had such a good day. I think this is just my ideal type of day, honestly. Like, just good food, good company. I went to two cafes today. I went and got a plant. I did some thrifting, even though it was unsuccessful. Like, just all those things together, that's a good day to me. So, I had a great day. I hope you enjoyed coming along. If you did, make sure to leave me a like and comment, subscribe. But if you're all also having good days, and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.